The Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office now releasing their full internal affairs investigation into the crash that killed 15-year-old Josiah Pinner. He always made us proud. He was a good kid. His mother, Johan Rojas, struggling to grieve, angry over some of the investigation's findings, including the undercover deputy's speed. According to the report, Deputy Philip Montesi was speeding when he hit the teen going more than 20 miles per hour over the speed limit. There's really no need to speed because it wasn't a, it wasn't a hot pursuit. At the time, Montesi was surveilling a bank employee, possibly involved in a drug transaction. According to the report, he got caught up in traffic and was speeding to catch up with her, going between 60 to 67 miles per hour in a 45 mile per hour zone. According to the report, after he hit the teen, he kept driving at 53 miles per hour for 24 more seconds before he hit the brake. The teen was not using a crosswalk when he was hit. And for more than two minutes, Montesi wasn't at the scene and didn't call for help. I don't want to ruin his life. It was an accident. Like, I'm just more angry that he didn't do what anybody else would have did. Stop, not leave, check on him. Like, he shouldn't be driving. This isn't the first time Montesi has hit a pedestrian. In 2017, he clipped a pedestrian with his side mirror. At the time, he was speeding and told investigators he was distracted by an in-car computer. If he did this in the past, it's very indicative that he'll do this in the future. Reporting in Tampa, Jordan Bowen, Fox 13 News.